Hey guys, sorry I've been late on uploads, but I had to take a mental break. Um, I just been working a lot and on top of that, I've been very sick. So I just have not been feeling good, but um, I'm going, it's nighttime right now and I'm gonna head to my house, like, and I'm gonna just do a house tour, finish, I'm gonna just do that real quick. Bella spilled tea on my fucking carpet, so that won't be right there. Um, but I'm just show y'all what I got for now. Okay, you guys, I just wanted to capture this part for you all at night. So the lights are off. I have the flash on the phone, but I actually have the volume of the lights turned down low because when I have it bright um, during the night, it looks like it's a party outside of my house. So... Yeah, I don't want to give off that impression in this nice neighborhood, but um, I'm going to turn on the mirror that's in front of us over here. Let's press that button and I can change the temperature. You can see it changing like that. I can turn it up really bright. I can turn it down really low to set the mood. Only if I had a nigga. And so... Right. Well, and that's the one I keep on, not this one. But um, I couldn't find this remote. I always lose this remote, so I had to turn that on. Um, I'm actually about to turn this off. I I really don't like this one because the remote it don't never want to act right. I have to like really point it at the back of this damn thing to turn it. Oh, come on, come on. Oh my goodness, no, Bell, get the fuck. Okie dokie. So. See how, oh yeah, I forgot I had those trash cans right there. So, uh, yep, it's a little messy in here tonight. I just got back. Yeah, y'all see my little 30 years crib. Had to delete the other house. Well, it wasn't a house tour, but I unboxed this fan art for you guys and it leaked too much information but luckily only 50,000 of you saw it and not a million so I changed my phone number what you saw in the box is no longer my phone number but it is my address if you come here you're gonna fucking die but no seriously don't pop up on me I'm gonna call the police no just kidding <laughs> if a fan would happen to show up then I might just break them in start talking because i don't have no fucking friends but i don't advise you to do that because it's gonna scare me <laughs> bella say good night i also want to let y'all know i won't be in this house um anymore because i'm just not happy being in a house like I've, I've i've always wanted to have like a skyview apartment something like that so i just haven't been happy in my house and it's just like a lot it's a lot of space it's, everything just feel empty including me so I'm just like over the whole house situation. But what I want to do is get a house for my mama. So she don't, she not catching on to the idea of that's what I'm trying to do. Cause I was like, no, I want a condo. And da da da, she's like, no, Kayla, da 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 da. And not realizing like, I'm still going to look at houses. You know what I'm saying? But I'd rather spend hundreds of thousands on a house for her, not for me. It's just a complete waste of money. I don't want to keep doing it. I don't want to finish it out. So I'm just about to just, I just been going back and forth with meetings, all this other shit. And you know what I'm saying? I'm not doing 600,000 for the house that I'm in because I just don't, I just, I'm over it. Like I don't want a house and I'm just too stressed out. Like a house to me. And then the way they want to keep pressure, I, I can't even, so much pressure from so much stuff like keep piling up and piling up like i'm just trying to take a freaking break so much pressure from so much stuff like keep piling up and piling up like i'm just trying to take a freaking break but i want y'all to hear from me and stuff like that like i don't want to not upload and all this other stuff because i i was gonna be consistent like i was the very first time I got a lot of good video ideas, and y'all y'all will see them soon, but I know everybody been messaging me, talking about when we get another video. Y'all's been supposed to get another video. I just been pro um, procrastinating and just forgetting, so it's just like, damn, I wake up. Well, I feel most motivated in the morning time, but as soon as I get up in the morning, it's something to do. I have to wake up 
and get straight to something like what the fuck so every morning something's in my way and later on in the day i end up forgetting about it but it's all it's on my mind heavy and i'm just like well damn i'm gonna do this i, I just keep thinking i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that but i don't, I don't even get to do it so um <clears throat> y'all don't get used to this house anymore um that i'm in currently because i'm leaving um and it's a good thing actually in that last video, I took it down because I didn't know opening the box. People zoomed in and got my phone number and my address. So I really, I don't even care about the house. But as much as I've been there, I have not been happy. First three weeks I was in there, I was interrupted. Like, oh, somebody wants, you know, just, just bullshit. So I just feel like I'm a visitor in my own house. All the money I put into it just going to waste. And I just don't want to fucking do it. If I do that. Like, I'm willing to buy, like, two to four houses just for investments, which I plan to do. And one of the houses will be for my mom, which she, she don't know that uh, yet, like I said. But for myself, I just really would like a nice condo with nice big windows, sky view. It's going to motivate me every day because it's so pretty. Um, So, I'm going to be looking at that in Atlanta and uh, with my realtor and stuff like that. Come back and look at this. Oh, that's a closet. Hmm. Ow. Oh, it's a linen closet. In the bathroom. Oh, and there's your mm -hmm. closet. Okay. All right. Yeah. I love this one. It's a little tiny, but the windows just make it look so big. And it's all I care about the view. But don't want a house because it's just like too much. Like I don't have kids, don't have a husband, I'm not old. I'm not ready to settle. So uh, not an apartment, but a condo. I'm willing to buy a condo. And then it's way more in my budget, like 200,000, not no half a million. Like, cause that's just doing a lot and pressuring me to go ahead and come up with, like just mm -mm. forget all that. I just wanted to let y'all know um, things will be a little different, but also, I'm going to bring Saint back. I know y'all been worried about Saint. Some people, I thought y'all forgot, but people was like, hey, where's Saint? You know what I'm saying? I didn't know that slipped y'all mind, but um, I'll be having Saint come from Alabama. But that's once I find a condo, you know what I'm saying, and I get in there and all this other shit. Because um, I think you can have a dog. You can have pets at a condo. So, I'm going to have him and Bella once again. Um, they haven't seen each other in a minute. But Saint is my baby. That's my boy dog for you all who don't know. I got Saint um, when I was 15 because I was like, that's when I was going through my depression. And I just felt like, damn. I really told myself if I end up having a baby, like I would be so, like I thought I needed a baby or a dog so I could have something to live for or to be my motivation. So, I ended up with a dog. Thank God. Not a baby. But that's that's why I love Saint so dearly. Because that's just... Me and him are like this. And he's so full of personality. Y'all know how Saint act. And I, I didn't never really put him on camera. Um, except for when I was... You know, back when I was real poor. Living in the trailer. I had him in one video before. But he, he kept crying. And I took it down a little bit. Because then people was like... I think somebody was saying... Like, bitch, I was like dead as broke as fuck like somebody said something about someone well, i just took the video down because i was like well oh well can't be normal on the internet like the fuck i'm so relatable until y'all see <laughs> like what the fuck like i be going through shit too or was but saint holds a special place in my heart saint i never get rid of saint and he's about to be i think he is two years old he turned two years old so um yeah because i'm 18 now i got him when i was 16 17, so I, I was with Trevor, my first boyfriend, the one before Neil. Um, and speaking of Neil, me and Neil are on good terms. Neil is currently in the army for those who are concerned about him too. Um, he's been gone three months now. Won't see him until November, but we talked, you know, we cried on the phone, da da da, woo, 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 woo. So 
that's still my husband. Um, Y'all can go follow his Instagram, No Limit Neil. I can't wait till he come back because Neil was also my happy place. Neil just understood me and just everything. Like, he been around so long because we the same type of person. Like, only problem we had was his maturity, which is why he left to the Army. He said he wanted to establish himself and he wanted to man up for me. So, currently, that's what we're dealing with. And I feel like we needed the space anyways because... I had became, I had became a toxic person, to be honest with y'all, towards the end. Um, I just felt like he wasn't growing, like, I just felt like I was growing, and he wasn't growing up. And it was just, like, we was bumping heads, like, it was just fucking irritating me. Like, I kept exploding on him and shit like that, but maybe it was just, like, I was moving so fast, everything going to my head, not forgetting, like, we ain't never had shit. Like, this boy don't know nothing about none of this internet stuff. He never gave a fuck. You know, we come from a small town, just a little country boy, not used to being under so much pressure. Like, I apologize. I had to apologize to him and just come, come to my senses. Like, I just got to, like, maybe, you know, half of that, it was, it was, he was a problem, but... Really, I had to, cons like, somebody, one of my fans, because y'all will keep it real. Y'all don't even sugarcoat for me. Well, my older my older fans do. The ones that be, like, grown and stuff. One of them was like, no, your problem is you started to feel like you were bigger than him. And he wasn't growing with you because you felt like you needed somebody on your level, which is okay. And I was like, damn, that's exactly how I feel. She said some other stuff. Like, she just read the fuck out of me. I was like, God, leave. So I appreciate my older girls that be on here because y'all y'all know exactly what, y'all know well what to say. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes I just have to hear it from somebody else because I be knowing. But then when you hear it from somebody else, it's like, bitch, you know? So thank y'all for watching this mini vlog. I just wanted to give y'all an update. My fucking arm hurt. Um, also, I'll be buying a ring light, so if y'all could drop some links or tell me where to get a good ring light and a stool and a tripod. But if I get a ring light with a little stand and a circle, I don't need a tripod. So I can get to making my videos like I was, get a good background and all this other shit. Um, I'll see y'all next time, okay? I love y'all. Oh, 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 check out my YouTube black performance okay i went to youtube black fan fest i was supposed to go to the summit but i just chickened out because this is way before like it was even close to doing all this i have public speaking anxiety so I, I thought we had to speak and i thought my voice was gonna be cracking i just said nah i ain't gonna do the summit part but i had just went to this high school um i forgot the name i put the name right here uh, it was really, really good. Like, I took pictures with them, and the class was so welcoming and everything else. And a lot of people don't know, I am currently still in school. This is my senior year. Um, I do online classes. I still attend my high school in Alabama, Silicaga High. Um, I'm done with my classes. I just had to walk across stage with everybody, May. So, shout out to Class of 2020, Infinity. Class of 2020. Stop making all that. Shout out to class of 2020. Oh, fuck. Um, here's a clip from my YouTube black. Y'all, I have to get used to all this little celebrity type shit. Cause, ooh, child. It's pissing me off. Like, low key, this is just a secret between us. I really hate um, that I became mainstream. Like, I don't like it. I hate it here. I hate it here. Can't y'all tell? Um, but yeah, so red carpets and all that, like, I didn't know that I was supposed to stop taking pictures. Like, I don't know. Lately, I've just been getting butterflies. Like, I don't know. But I'm really proud of myself. I'm really thankful. I underestimate myself a lot, not realizing a lot of people have love for me. So I really want to thank y'all for showing so much love, being there for me, and just appreciating me. Because that's why I got on the internet. That's why I got on YouTube. Because I wanted to be around people with positivity. And I wanted to reach more people. And I did. And it just was always happy. My YouTube audience was my happy place. So thank y'all for still being that. I'm about to insert a clip of my YouTube performance. And the red carpet. Oh, but I was going to say, yeah. I kept getting nervous like when fans was taking pictures. Like I was shaking a little bit. I was like, oh, I'm just ready to get out the way. Like, and I apologize for that if I gave anybody those vibes. Like, I just, I just gotta get used to this stuff. Like, it's just so weird, but 
don't know. <laughs> ah, here's my performance. Now you've seen my girl face. You've seen my girl face all over the internet. Nicole TV girl, what's up, bitch? All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, now the beauty of the beauty. Listen, like a snake. Yes, what you, you got for me? It? What I you can, got for me? I can do it for you, I can do it for you. So that was my YouTube performance. Here's how I dress. Uh, this is my friend, as you can see, yeah. she's still bad in and out. Here, right here. But no, you're looking good, friend. Thank you you're so much. You're looking good. Move like a snake in the Oh, oh, move like a snake. Didn't really take any pictures. Didn't really, you know, because I didn't even, I didn't even stand still. But um, I was glad to see other YouTube personalities. So thank y'all for watching this video. Next video will, of course, be more upbeat, but y'all not on pretend shit. So I'll be looking forward to the therapist comments in the comment section. See y'all again. Bye.